today is going to be awesome but a little bit controversial you understand because the question is going to be a little bit weird you may actually find yourself in between not being able to answer the question but what is the question now let's throw this in let's assume okay let me play this scenario you are a born again christian i mean a real born again christian not just a church goer yeah you are a damn real born again christian things of christ is what pleases you yeah we all read the bible and we know how christ will live his life and the rest of them so now the things that christ does is what you are trying to emulate in fact in your church you are used as an example of living the upright life in your family you are known as a person of integrity honesty in your place of work you are truthful and when they are using as doing an example for something nice you are the one that has been used now despite all this thing there's something that is eating you up yes there's something that it is eating you up and what is it your loved one is sick your loved one could be your mom could be your dad could be your brother could be your sister could be your spouse or it could be your child somebody very dear to your heart is sick you are spend all the money that you can nothing to show for it funny enough let me play this dicey scenario now this is where you're going to pay a little bit of attention your pastor has prayed you know it seems like nothing is happening something is actually happening in the spiritual let's play that example Ch uh, prayer warriors have prayed leaders in the church mothers everybody has prayed and your loved one is still very very sick and looks like he or she will be dying very soon from that illness now after all after exhausting everything you can in the right way nothing comes up now you have this brother of yours and a sister either a brother or a sister of yours who is also a born again christian the person that looks out for you all the time he rather hurts you with the truth than please with the lie they can't see something that will benefit you and deny you of that thing now this sister or brother of yours you went to visit him or you went to visit her and at the point of having a conversation one of his siblings or her siblings comes out and after having this normal greetings he says to you brother sister why not bring your loved one to papa let's see what papa could do yeah everywhere was a little bit quiet one minute silence you look at your friend born again friend he or she didn't say anything you look at your si the sibling the sibling is this yes bring your loved one to papa let's see what papa could do who is their father their father is a renounced native doctor baba lawoma dibia yes he's a native doctor he doesn't believe in christ he doesn't care about christ yes he's a native doctor he practice traditional but he has years of experience of curing such illness that is disturbing your loved one that is about to take your loved one from you the whole symptoms that has that is actually showing up he has killed so many patients with such illnesses now you are now in between somebody who almost everybody looks out who upcoming born again christian want to live his or her type of life who is being used as an example for the life that christ lived in the church in the market whatever you have been found they discuss christ in fact everybody said that that guy in fact that is christ in our present time or that lady is christ in our present time now will you take your loved one to a native doctor the fact is that you may say why not the native doctor come home and treat him no you have to bring him to the shrine not actually present him to the gods as a sacrifice <laughs> but the fact is that you keep him or her in the place where he treats people which he has to you know go find the house and the leave you used to treating them see that their father is a native doctor does not stop those your born again brothers from taking care of their father yes they make sure that whatever it is that their father needs they provide for him food clothes car good house or in fact no matter how small they could provide for their father they are doing it whether they are rich or managing but they make sure that they take care of their father their father first before any other thing now will you take your loved one to your friend's father for treatment that question look a little bit dicey right now that is it so i urge every single one of you to go down the comment section and tell me what you think don't forget to share 
don't forget to like and uh, yeah let's do this okay it sounds a little bit weird and controversial i understand why is king goma always a controversial person he always asks questions that is very controversial yeah that is me king goma mr controversy so that is it and i call on mr freeze our geos uh, you know daddy geos and mommy geos tell us what you think if you heard that your friend your member your top-notch member who is leaving the opera right, suddenly take his loved one to native doctor's house for treatment what would be your your opinion thanks for watching on my youtube channel don't forget to subscribe and the rest of them see you guys